His name is Pat, and he buys crap every Saturday and Sunday. You'll know where he's at. Take a guess, it's Flea Market Madness. Oh, yes, it's Flea Market Madness. And me, Frank. Prepare yourself for a slightly overcast Flea Market Madness. Whoa, a Famicom system. I think I've found maybe two of those ever at the swap meet. How much for the game system? This one's 75. 75? Do you know what this is? It's an early Nintendo. It was a Japanese version of Nintendo before it came here. There's also a few Famicom games here. You have 1942, which came out here. Yeah. Galaga. It's boxed. Oh wow, you have a whole bit of it. You know what? I I have nothing with it. <laughs> you got nothing that's none of the Yes the box. You don't have the AC adapters or anything? No, I don't have What about uh, for the Xbox? I, I want 20 with the two controllers in this one. I, That's not a bad deal. I, <laughs> I'll give you everything for 50 bucks if you like it, the controls. Okay. This this. Here's the cord for here. Oh, okay. For that one. Oh, okay. This, no. okay, here's the power for the PlayStation. Oh. That goes to that. <laughs> See, I'm helping you out. <laughs> That's a lot of G.I. Joe vehicles, but they're from a collector, so they won't be cheap. All right, box Nintendo games. A lot of good box NES games and Super Nintendo games here, too. But all these games are from an older collector's stash, and he wants eBay prices. Now you got Chubby Trevor. I'm still looking for the box for Chubby Trevor. That one doesn't come up too often. Uh, this is not a good day so far. Here lies every Xbox controller ever. <sighs> Got two of them. This guy's picked up a vintage Millennium Falcon Star Wars toy. It's not complete, but most of the parts are here, and for a flea market find, that's good. Here's an Apple IIe sitting under the table. Where's Ian to spaz out? A box of NES games, but the lowest price on any is $5. And then they just go up from there. I yearn for the day of $2 and $3 NES games. Here's a seller with some stuff, including a Neo Geo X console, which basically just emulates a Neo Geo. How much on the uh, Nintendo and the games? Uh, the Nintendo is uh, 40 bucks and the games uh, $5 each. Five each? You give me a discount if I got a bunch of them? Oh, come on. It's cheap. You, you can't give me a discount? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Three or two is cheap. Five is all right. I found a random Sega Genesis AC adapter, but where is the system? Oh, I found it. It was a Genesis Model 3. Nice. Is that a game? Five bucks. Five? Yeah. Cool. Here's a couple of Atari systems and games. I'm so interested. Ten bucks on Duck Hunt. Six. Twelve on World Games? <laughs> this is an NES controller in a Pro Power Grip, which was just a piece of plastic for the controller to sit in. They may be a little bit hard to find, but they're junk. Wow. We got a 3DO. Which is the FC1, which I do have. Oh, so you wanted 100 on the games, you said? And 100 on this? Yeah. $100 for five Neo Geo AES games is almost a steal. But it turns out there are only two games here, and the other three are just the cases. I love digging through cheap PC games. Okay, love may be a strong word. I like it. Alright, it doesn't bother me too much. Okay, it's annoying. How's it going, Frank? Yeah, good. Yeah, I keep, uh, I kept seeing you, like, down at the end going the opposite. That's Sinatra's mug shot? Yeah. What is he arrested for? I don't know, but it's Bergen County, and that's New Jersey. Could be you if you shaved. This guy wants 45 for the Genesis system and games, but there's nothing too special in there. Hey, Frank. Yeah? Animated series, volume one, Batman. Here's some video game training for you. You see these green booklets? That, yeah. That, these are original Xbox. These games are, are mostly worthless. So don't uh, buy them ever, Frank. Not that you would, but... Yeah, I'm not really a game guy. No? 
You end up getting that Nintendo on Friday? It's not working. It doesn't work? And I cannot. I mean, I, it's something, you know, usually it's, it's cleaning, it's yeah. to that, uh, to, uh, you know, that, those, those pins, you know, the 72 pins. Uh huh. Yeah. It's rare, I guess it can happen, right? Yeah, it happens. That's the normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he's full of shit. So basically what happened was I was negotiating for a system and games and then he came in after I was already negotiating and then tried to get the deal. I wasn't going to argue that he got him and now he's claiming that the system doesn't work, which is bullshit. This is way of trying to make me feel better. Are, are, those, are those vintage? Yeah, I don't know. They just look cool. I don't know. They, Made in know China. Me. I'm not a collector. I'm a, yeah. well, well, go for it if you want it. Here's the Donkey Kong Country Super Nintendo set, which is fairly uncommon. This doesn't have the Donkey Kong Country cart, but a Super Mario World in its place. That's almost an even trade. The seller wants fifty dollars, which is a good deal. Missing the game, but I can find the game. Missing the game. It's okay, except it's missing the game. It's like well, it's a car without an engine. I mean, not necessarily. <laughs> it, it's great, well, except there's no engine. Uh oh. The superhero's greatest battles. And the superhero women. How much is the, uh, the battles? Are these together? You gotta buy both of them? Oh, uh, no, but it'll give you a better deal. If you buy both, it'll give them both for 40 or 25 each. Just check on eBay, see maybe one or two on there. And they're like, Mentioning an eBay price to Frank? He doesn't even know what eBay is. 19, 1941, Spielberg, comedy. Oh, yeah, I, did you see that? It's goofy. I've seen parts of it, it's yeah. goofy. Yeah, beat the devil. Which was a, a flop when it came out, but then people realized that it was, was funny. Like it was, it was tongue in cheek, and then all they of a sudden realize it. looked at it in a different light and it became like a classic. It's yeah. funny as hell. Sort of like a goof on Mal the Maltese Falcon. Okay. Where, you know, bogeys in it, but uh, Gina Lola Bridget is in that. God, she's. Not bad. I mean, you just. I don't know how you stand next to her and not put your hands on her. I mean, it's just. <laughs> how much is Kresk in ESP? Three yeah. dollars. Should we go over for three bucks, Frank? Well, I don't. But if you want it, needs a home. Needs a home, Frank. What do you think? Nice. I'll do two on it. You gonna do two? Right now, let's buy it. Yeah. Two bucks, Frank. Let's do it. Save that game. Right. Nice, a Coleco Galaxian tabletop game. The condition isn't the best, but who cares? Could you go eight on this? All right, thanks. So yeah, I, play, I played chess in high school. I was on the chess team, so not a lot of dates for me then, unfortunately. Oh. <laughs> but, uh, now they're all running after you. Oh yeah, I say chess, they come running. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. <laughs> You're not sure, Frank? <laughs> I'm trying to figure the logic here. Went under the gun to get everything Frank, can, can, you, can you fit in these, these well, gold ones, you think? This is like just your style. I told you not to, 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 not to say that. <laughs> I <laughs> that. I think the leopard ones would all Leopard ones? <laughs> I have those, actually. Okay, all right. <laughs> I mean, what do you have to have alien feet to fit in that? Look at that. <laughs> alien feet. Look at it, they're like... My hands are ugly enough, but you imagine what my feet look like? I mean, really. <laughs> I hope you had fun in this mildly successful flea market madness. Bye!